heavily and we couldn't hear anything because of the rain on the roof so I decided to just start the vlog today and just start with a clean fresh vlog it's about 6 30 in the morning and we're supposed to be on track at 6 a.m. but I was feeling a little lazy so I pushed it back a bit but first off is we're gonna sign in get our wristbands and then park the car pick up the Miata and then suit up to practice for the first practice session uh, qualifying will be around midday and then I think the first race is after lunch and the second race is also after lunch now being that there are a few drivers per car there's gonna be two qualifying sessions because it's gonna be also an afternoon qualifying session and it's gonna be tricky because I know my teammate Windy is pushing in the 218 bracket as well as I am so the group's getting faster it's not gonna be an easy stroll in the park I don't know if Yuha is here, Yuha has been on a European travel tour and I don't know if this, he, he's been practicing also Okay guys, we are in the Ferrari paddock again, here are my teammates This guy is so fast already, Windy's pushing a 218 in Mark's car But there's a little clincher today, we found out that Tyson is running also in the back Which means it's gonna be harder to be in the front <laughs> Our coach is now fielding the grid and that's sad for all of us Because now everyone gets bumped up automatically one space down <laughs> Wait, so what car are you running? I'm running uh, Tito Windy's car. And then what's the Windy running? Uh, I think this one. Wait, how many cars do you have? <laughs> Using Tito and S car. This one. Because uh, in the States, eh? that's Tito Charlie's car. That's the car I used last time. Uh, <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> okay, so the order or the pecking order will be Tyson in Windy's car, Windy in Renes car. No, this is Charlie's car, and Dino in Renes car. Where are these other drivers? <laughs> anyway, again, it's good. Looks like it's gonna be uh, overcast day. Weather looks beautiful. Morning. Okay, I'm gonna warm up, put the camera down. I'll see you guys again later. Timer. Wala ka timer? 
<laughs> so on my second lap, I miraculously clocked a 217.54. And I wasn't even trying. I was trying to break in the brakes. And Tyson was saying, that's the fastest lap when you're relaxed. So when I started pushing it, I started doing 219. <laughs> Anyway, we're off to the driver's briefing real quick and then uh, our qualifying is at 8.30 if I'm not mistaken yep. and then the first race is at 9 something and then our second race is this afternoon. The grid is full or the paddock is full. Briefing's done, let's go racing. During qualifying in the next 15 minutes, we're getting ready because we're gonna try to follow Tyson. For my 217.54 lap, it was a super easy drive and when I was pushing, it's 219, so I gotta relax, I gotta chill and just enjoy the drive. I'll see you guys again after qualifying. I just changed because I was sweating so much but I managed to do a 17.8 following Tyson and then after the one lap Tyson went in and I did a 17.9 I think and then on my own lap I did a 17.66 Here's Windy! Sorry, I could not because, oh, because of Paris. I know. We don't have official times yet. I don't know if my times are counted. I don't know if I exited the track at any time. But I know I'm pretty safe with my track limit. According to Windy, he got flagged for going off track. I'm actually quite curious what Tyson and Alan's times are. Tyson had to pull in because his car was experiencing some noise in the suspension. And I need to now visit Alan and figure out what time did he get. Let's go for a ride. Thank you for a special delivery. <laughs> Thank you for the deli delivery. Weather Tech Pista. Grab, grab delivery. Well, it's not my pista. <laughs> I wish. I like yeah. it. But everyone Giving is coach a hard time. So he got a 17.3. If I am 17.6. And he's now setting up his car. Forced, I'm forced to set up the car. He wants to catch Tyson. Because of you guys. So we'll wait for official time. Yeah, lowering suspension pa. Wait, wait, digita ng cam. Sayang, so Windy got caught doing off track limit. So yeah. he's now 12th on the grid. So the order is uh, Tyson, Alan, myself, and Yuha. Okay, race is in the next uh, 15 minutes. I'll update you guys again when we finish.
this year. Tyson got second. Wendy ended sixth. Six. Six. Oh, okay. So what happened at the start? Uh, Tyson had a good takeoff, but Alan's car seems to be faster. Alan creeped into the inside line and was able to squeeze out to be first. I held third all the way and no drama all the way. And the MSCC crew. Hello. Hello. <laughs> anyway, we ended up third in position and I was actually taking it easy because Yuha and Paul were in the back and then Tyson and Alan were in the front and I was actually doing my own thing. Now, the first lap was kind of messy because Paul was able to overtake me on the inside line but I was able to grab him also on the hairpin. So after that, everything settled down and oh, wow. Um, we have a taxi ride with Shell later at 12 and then after that, the next race and qualifying will be in the afternoon. So uh, I'll post another video later. Session number two, I'm not feeling so hot, having a stiff neck. Um, Tyson's car is acting up, but they're gonna try to run it also. So let's see how we place. On the practice session of the second session, I was doing 219, which is super slow. Tyson was saying because it's hot, you need to take it a little easier on the car, because if not, just squirming everywhere. So I gotta learn how to control. I'll see you guys again in a bit. Honestly, this vlog is looking super lazy. I'm not even using the GoPro to film. I'm just using the V-Box video. We're not going to put everything, but I will probably put the fastest lap. Some of you have requested a full lap from me so that you can see how I drive the car. But uh, for qualifying, on the second qualifying, we clocked like a 2.18.7 if I'm not mistaken. So I'm hoping that's good enough to be in the top again. And then uh, Tyson on the way out couldn't run the car, so he didn't qualify. So which means it's gonna be me, Alan, Yuha. Wendy did a 2.19, so he's behind me. So I'm hoping that yeah, we are in the top grid again and hopefully we can defend the position and bring home another trophy. It is a hot day. I was stretching my neck a while ago because yeah, I felt like it was cramping up already. But yep, for now, I'm just gonna hydrate and then get ready because the race is in like 20 minutes. So hopefully we're going to bring home again a trophy. I'll update you guys again later.
Okay, race two just finished. Huh? You flipped them off back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's so pissed. Oh, it's so pissed. I'm just going to go in the car. So I just like save the car. It's not even racing. I'm going to go. It's just wooden. hardcore blocking. That's what's happening. I have it on video. Pakita it on Andre. I have it on. I, I, I saw you think you were behind. right behind you guys. I thought I lost it. Someone in the show was like, oh shit, I don't know where to go. Please stop. 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 Okay guys, so race 2 just finished. It was a very, very intense race. I first started the car and it had a check engine. We had to remove the battery, get on grid. A lot of the people on the grid didn't make it because of some damages to some of the cars. And then on the third or fourth lap, the guy Perez actually runs me off the road and I was able to save it. So thank God the car is still running. It was a slight push, but he was such a messy driver. And I ended up in the dirt, one hand, saved it, cut back in, and then Tyson and Windy's car started acting up. So I was able to crawl to second. So we finished second place, but what a race. I'm gonna post that video so you guys can see it. Anyway, awarding is at 4.30. If I'm not mistaken so we're gonna wait for the awarding in a bit and then we're just gonna go home and relax and rest it was such an intense day so visibly there's not much damage to the car but that's basically his rear bumper pushing me into the dirt and we were able to save the car I'll post the footage but yeah rubbing side by side so this is all him this this contact here all the way till there doesn't look like much but at that speed it's pretty quick uh, I'm surprised the wheels don't have any visible scarring. Second place and third place. Okay, headed to awarding and... It's okay, man. It's okay, though. <laughs> so that was Patrick Hesse. He had parts from my car and he basically totaled his car on the way up because he hydroplane. I'm wearing a Petrona shirt to a shell event. Double drifting. <laughs> Doing the fastest time of 2 minutes 17.9 seconds. And she came. And in first place, none other than Alan Hui. For the novice class, I may Miguel Alvarez. Tyson C. And first place, again, making it a habit, Alan Oi. Thank you, Kathy. Kathy is my camera woman. Thank you. Okay, now we can officially go. And that's it. Me and Tyson are walking back so we can pack up and get out of here. This is the trophies that I got also in the first second race. Tyson would have made me third. Edgen in the back. Okay. Okay guys, we're finally back in the car and I'm going to end this vlog. Thank you so much to Mazda Philippines, the organizers and the sponsors, to my teammates Tyson and Windy and obviously to Edgen and his crew. Don from Mazda Philippines, thank you so much. It was a very interesting race. The first race was super clean and then the second race was not so clean. And when we showed the video to the organizers, they were saying I was already on the grass, which I wasn't. 
Um, I'll let you guys decide. What do you think the call should have been? Please comment down below. But till then, I will see you guys again in the next episode.